Good morning from Paris. So beautiful. Okay. Good morning. Bonjour. Uh, good morning. It is actually the afternoon, but um, we we are starting off the day a little bit later than we have. It's been kind of nice just to chill and not have like a set plan. Roman and I fully anticipated just having like days of playgrounds and parks and just walking around and that's precisely what we're doing. Um, aside from the Eiffel Tower, we have nothing else planned. Linnea is wearing probably my favorite dress I've ever gotten for her. Come on. You're nice to animals? Yeah. You sure are. Yeah, we don't really have much planned. Just playgrounds, parks, just, you know, taking in the ambiance and just trying to help the kids make a connection to the country that they're visiting. So it's been cool because like yesterday they had a clip and they've been um, really interested in the Seine and the Eiffel Tower and it's just kind of cool to, um, to have these memories with them. And both the kids have said, oh, we need to come back here. And it's just really, it's special. France is a special place to me. Uh, it's a special place for us as a couple because Roman and I, we actually came here for our honeymoon uh, nine years ago. So almost 10, it's crazy. It was wonderful and lovely and beautiful and just a really special time. So it's cool to be back with our children and I've really enjoyed our time here. We've all made good memories and we've made good memories together and we're just all having fun. Here we are at the Louvre. We are not going inside because I just think there are too many people. Yeah, and they're going to have so many people. And every place says, oh, we, they don't crowd. We don't allow crowding, but yet everybody crowds. So we're going to stay outside, but the kids wanted to see the outside of the building and they wanted to see the pyramid, which is totally fine. So we're going to do that and then go across to the garden and hang out here for the afternoon. You guys see the pyramid? You like put on another one? Wait, I thought it was a pyramid. Hmm? You just called a triangle. Yeah, because if she looks from here, then she sees a triangle. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, got confused for a second. I was like, wait, what? This is Le Louvre. It is so big. Like, I can't even. It's just, gosh. You could, you could, like, I think they said something like you could walk an entire month and still not see everything. Or something like that. I can't remember what it was, but here. And then this, this reminds me of London. London had arches like this. This looks like Wellington Arch in London. You're not? Yeah, but there's enough, you have enough space here. We left the garden, which is right there. And the Louvre is behind us right there. And then we're walking across the Seine because the shuttle, here's the shuttle that we were supposed to be on, the water shuttle. Um, but we missed it because we were kind of dawdling a little bit. Here's one of my favorite museums in the world, right there. Um, the Musée d'Orsay. They have, it's a whole museum full of Impressionism. It's beautiful. And we decided to walk home. Which is what we're doing. Yeah. This is so nice. We're taking the scenic route back. Just walking. And in the shade, which is so nice. Most of the people are up. So we are not. Yeah, there are a lot of things that I would have loved to do if, and because the weather's been great, there are a lot of things that I would have loved to do 
had it not been for COVID. But it just didn't seem, it's like at Disney, we were at Disney, but we were still in a pandemic. So we had to like, you know, keep ourselves away from people. Cam, I'm gonna take your picture. I absolutely love this. Just sit right there. 